So here we are on the very first outing of Banana Castle at the club track. We've just literally left the steaming dock and making our way down the first straight. The rules of this track are 4 miles per hour, which is uh, literally a fast walking pace. Uh, the curves are not designed for high speeds and we will derail. We do have other locomotives on the track today. So this is the first swooping corner. We're going through a dugout section, which is uh, held back by some slabs there on the left hand side. As we come out of the swooping left bend, we go into another straight. Which then takes us on to a right hand swooping corner, which takes us around the back of the steaming bay. Uh, round past the clubhouse, which we can now see there in front of us. And then we go down the back of the left hand side of the track. We have a small incline here, so more power needs to be applied. As you can see, the locomotive slows down. And then we head into a downhill descent into what I like to call the flower bed section we've got some snow drops there on the right hand side spring is on its way on the left there we've got the carriage shed uh, and a track for ingesting or adding those locomotives from that shed onto the track some points you can hear just there we go over those points going too fast there will cause us to derail so caution required and this is the straight back towards the station. It's the longest straight on the whole track. Um, this is where we can get the maximum amount of speed as we head down towards the station, which we can now see there in front of us. We we'll take a right swooping bend into the station. As we head through the station, we have a water butt there on the left. The siding, again on our left, take us into the steaming and preparation bay and then back to where we began, onto the straight past the steaming bay.